Thank you so much. It's uh, difficult to follow that footage after the horrendous events of September the 1st, which are so hard to, to look at the faces of these people and see that film and to think what happened there, uh, to know that our assurances maybe have not been upheld as they should have been. Prime Minister Maliki of Iraq needs to be told and will be told that uh, the hostages need to be treated humanely and they should be released as soon as possible. He should apologize. He should uh, try to make, there's not much he can do to make right, but treating the hostages is the least he can do. And we need to be calling on John Kerry, which we will, my friend, the Secretary, to uphold the U.S. commitments to the residents who are deemed protected persons by our actions in 2004 and as asylum seekers by the U.N. Refugee Agency in 2011. There are certain rights that they have coming to them as in that capacity, and the United States and the U.N. need to live up to its to our values and our commitments. It's extremely difficult to see what's happened, and we need to make sure that the remaining residents at Camp Ashraf and Camp Liberty are treated well. I will work on behalf of those residents and also see that justice is done. Thank you very much. Thank <laughs> you.